September 7th. The reading is taken from Hoshea chapter 1 verse 10. It shall come to pass that in the place where it was said unto them, Ye are not my people. There it shall be said unto them, Ye are the sons of the living God. The key in this verse is hope. All of us are sinners. We are born dead in our transgressions. All of us have fallen short of the glory of God. Yet, God says, Ye are not my people. There it shall be said unto them, Ye are the sons of the living God. Some of us are so decidedly ungodly, writes Charles Spurgeon, that the Lord's word most truly said to our consciences and hearts, Ye are not my people. In the house of God and in our own homes, when we read the Bible, this was the voice of God's Spirit in our souls. Ye are not my people. Truly a sad and condemning voice, is it not? But then again, we hear the same voice. Ye are the sons and daughters of the living God. Can we be grateful enough for this? Is this grace not wonderful? Does it not give us hope for others who is beyond the reach of Almighty grace? No one. How can we despair of any since the Lord has wrought so marvelous a change in us? He who has kept this one great promise will keep every other promise. Therefore, let us go forward with songs of adoration and confidence that the Lord will make it happen. Amen and amen to this.